so that concludes our discussion. Thank you so much, Michelle and and John. That's been really insightful. But just that's a lot of a lot of information. There's a lot of insights, and I know we'll add a link to the report, and everybody can access the, the full insights. But just sort of looking at what we've discussed, what would be the three takeaways, the three action points that retailers must be doing right now um, to sort of future future proof their way to success? If we could condense it into three must-haves, what would you say? Mm -hmm. Well, that is difficult, but necessary, right? Um, I would say evaluate your customer service. It's a running theme. It's the worst experience that someone can have. It can be a profit center. Um, you know, your retail peers have identified it as, uh, a, as the number one opportunity for them. So really look hard at your uh, customer service to see if it's to the standards that you want. Is it meeting your shoppers' needs? So um, evaluate that and iterate on it if, if need be. The second, right, is to um, start building towards that unified engagement platform. That's going to be the basis of everything that happens now. And that is really driven by data, right? You can't have artificial intelligence. You can't have personalization if you don't have all of the data in one place accessible for every part of the business, including the store associates. And I know that's a big undertaking, but really need to think through how you um, really integrate everything and make it accessible for, for people and for the, the models that you'll need to do all of these different uh, data-based actions. And then the third is just understanding that consumer behavior has shifted and influence over purchases, actual transactions and services are happening wherever people are thanks to technology. So are you delivering um, the experiences that are truly omni-channel? Are you at the right spaces where your customers are, 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 are spending time so you can influence them, offer a transaction or offer a service?